For those who saw the previous video of this car smoking like a freight train, this is kind of like a continuation of that video. I now have, let's see, right here it is. I now have the turbocharger out and I can see exactly where the failure occurred, what was causing the noise and all the smoke. And it most certainly was a turbo bearing failure. So there's the turbo removed out of the vehicle, super easy. It only took about an hour, probably a little bit less actually, to do all this. And one of the big reasons is because it comes out as a whole assembly. So, as you can see, <laughs> here is the old one. Let me get the light on on my camera. Here's the old turbo, and you can see the wheel is just completely gone. It's all chewed up there. You gotta grab it here, it's got... So, the bearing has just completely failed. And that's what the rattling noise was in there. So when the bearing got play in it, it destroyed the seal and started pumping oil and, co and you can see coolant in there as well and all that good stuff into the exhaust and the intake. Here's a catalytic converter soaked in oil, which is also going to get replaced. It was setting, a, setting an efficiency code, so it's just packed with oil. Here's a new turbocharger. You can see that one's good and tight. That's how it should be. And the new catalytic converter, you can see the difference. This is the uh, post converter side of the cat. You can see the different colors there, the dark spots where it's failing. If we spin around here, look at the, look at the intake side here, or the uh, pre-converter, you can see how it's just loaded with oil, and the new one is all clean. So anyway, there's the turbo failure right there. This is on a 15 cruise, this one has about, I forget how many miles this thing had on it. Say, 2015 and it has uh, let's see, where's the mileage? 22,000 miles on this car. So there's a, there's a failure. Got the old ones and the new ones lined up with each other. Uh, we'll go back together and get these all straightened out. See if it clears the code out. 